Thursday night at the Betty Engelstead Sioux Center in Grand Forks. North Dakota defeated Portland State 76-45 in Big Sky Conference women's basketball. With Greg Steeman, I'm Dan Hammer, and this is your Midco SN post-game wrap. North Dakota led from start to finish, and really I was never in doubt, Greg, in this basketball game. Yeah, you, you talked about dominated, do, dominating performance for 40 minutes, jumped out to a quick start, and really had Portland State on their heels all night, and they really had no answer for a number of different things that UND threw at them. One of those wins that Coach Brewster was able to rest some players and get them ready for a big game on Saturday. One of the themes for North Dakota coming into this game was to have a better start at the beginning of the game and the second half. And their start as we take a look at the first half highlights was very good on Thursday night. It, it was a great ball movement, Dan. I think you talked about a 15 assists on 18 made field goals. Most of the field goals we see in the highlights as Zavala buries his three pass from Burke. Look at the pass that leads to almost every score. Emily Ever was uh, playing by foul troubles, played just uh, nine minutes at six points on the night. Michaela Rabard active. She fouled out of the game, though, for Portland State. But again, ball moved by North Dakota. Here's Megan Loud for three. Yeah, big three. And then just we saw some transition opportunities. Maya Lloyd from Zabla. Almost every basket came from somebody that Kelsey Knox. There's no assist on this play no. because the ball never leaves her hand. She gets all the way to the rim. Nobody stops it. Great effort, great energy by North Dakota. Leah Zabla, Kelsey Knox flashing big smiles as UND was having some fun. Grace Swatsky, very unselfish play, dished it back out to Zabla, and then Knox uh, with a little extra duty here in the defensive end. And this was this kind of embodied their effort and their focus, I think, by UND tonight is just if we got to get on the floor and scrap for everything we get, we're going to do it, and that's what Knox did. North Dakota ends up 27 of 66 from the field, but in the first half it shot 56%. And in the first half, 18 made field goals, 15 assists. That really set the tone for the entire game. They built a 25-point lead at the half, and they win going away by 31. North Dakota had the rebounding edge, and Maya Lloyd with uh, 14 points, 13 different North Dakota players scored in the game. Actually had good production from a lot of the people off the bench and in extended minutes, so it was nice to see that to get quality game experience for a lot of players that maybe at times don't normally see it. North Dakota moves to 9-5 and five in the Big Sky. Next up, a very important date with Sacramento State Saturday afternoon, 2 o'clock here at the Betty and here on Midco Sports Network. Greg and I will see you then.